Number two is we're talking about uh, a city from the environment point of view, which is healthier, but also a, a, a society that feel a sense of unity, sense of togetherness. You know, if any of you have spent time in Jakarta and contemplate a little bit, uh, our city is actually a somewhat segregated city where there is kampung, pack, crowd, crowded, hot, humid, and then you have complex in which, you know, uh, area in which nice housing were there, and then you have uh, main business districts with nice offices, and then next to it you have slum area. So there is that segregation without us realizing, and it's naturally uh, evolved. So, you know, as, as someone who took this responsibility, I thought we need to address this problem. We should not let this problem continue, but the way to address it is not in a traditional uh, way. So our approach in, in addressing this issue is by creating this public transport. And when public transport were operating, it is a facility that create equal treatment. You may be a CEO, you may be a governor, you may be a, a mayor. When you enter an MRT, when you enter a bus, you will stand on the same line. You will sit on the same chair, you will stand on the same car, and there is no business lounge, there is no business class, it's all equal. And in a city like Jakarta, that is a rare experience. Even when you go to malls, uh, many of you know uh, Bundaran HI area. There are three malls in Bundaran HI. One is Plaza Indonesia, the second is Grand Indonesia, and the third, any of you knows the third malls? Uh, Tamrin City, right. Tamrin City. Uh, yes, there is, there is EX2, uh, north of it. So those who come to Tamrin City did not dare to enter Plaza Indonesia. And the same thing, those who come to Plaza Indonesia didn't even look at Tamrin City. This is a completely different segment of our society. What we like to do is to create space that give a feeling of equality, that create a feeling of, of uh, unity. And that's why we built many, what we call third space. Let me wipe this. So third space, in the case of Jakarta, was this. First space is at home. Second space is at work. And the th third space is our common space. This is a space. And in the past, this has been mostly provided by private sectors. And when private sectors create third space, they have to create a certain tar market target thing. They could not create just for anyone. Uh, and that's why we're doing reforms, public transport, two parks, three sidewalks, that all were, were developed because we would like to build a third space that unite, a third space that create a feeling of, of uh, equality uh, to all. We're talking about public transport, and then we build uh, public parks, no less than 370 public parks, 29 urban forests. And the idea is to make sure that our population is able to find a third space that create the feeling of uh, equality. Mm -hmm.